It is 7.30 in the morning as I am getting this squared away with. Oh boy, I am, I don't know what I'm doing. Starting with an eternal cylinder stream in the morning, but I mean, hey, here we are. If you notice my voice sounds a little different, the sound a little deeper, it's because I am just waking up. Alright, I gotta test the audio so that way then everything is working. I just have my iPad here, so... Uh. Sounds fine enough as it is. Um, let me adjust audio first, because I know for a fact that, like, some games are gonna have to have it differently. Uh, more options. Game volume, turn that down a little bit. And then... I think that's it. Let's continue. Um, so I do know kind of how this game kind of ends. There is a, like a boss fight, obviously, but I don't know how it works exactly, so I'll have to figure that out when we get there, but that'll be for a while. Um, from what I saw from a full playthrough, it is an eight hour long game, so. Huh. But, uh, I'm probably gonna end up making it like twice as much, so let's see here. I'm just trying to figure out the controls now. So B is to eat, gotta remember that. Are there any troops with us? No, it does not appear to be. Oh god. What is the button to roll again? X. That is vile. Is it following us? It appears that way. Yeah. Well, only one thing to do. And off we roll to our destiny. I think we're dead, actually. Unless maybe, can we hide under here? Uh, nope, uh, apparently not. <laughs> Jesus, so it's been that long since we last played the game? That is, that is not good. Yeah, let's get out of here. While we get out of that sticky situation, let's try and find a better route. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, hey. Well, um, give me one moment. Hmm. There we go. Another member of the 5th Idiot Division. One of our newer ones, too, so that's kind of funny. Cool. Um, well, now that you're here, we gotta be careful of that guy over there. Right, it's that button to eat. Could have sworn he spawned somewhere else last time we ended off. Last time's video. God damn it. We can hide it here at least.
We need to get out of here. Like, now. Oh, no. I did not mean to come down here. There we go. Thank you, Sky, for not following me down there. Careful of that. Don't get caught in the light. What is this? Oh, right. We probably should have Sky adjust this. Right, now she can breathe the gas. Sorry if I'm not gravitating much. I am, again, still waking up. Even though I got rid of, ready for the day. Ugh. Um, today I will be go. I will be seeing the Garfield movie. From what I heard, it's pretty darn good. So excited to see that. Um. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Pretty good. Oh, you can only have a max of ten. Okay. Well, now I think we're ready. Trying to make sure... Okay, I think we have a straight path. Let's get ready. What, what the? was this monstrous creature? Was this one of the cylinder servants? The ones the elder had warned them of? Its very form terrified the Trevor. Even the voice on their memory seemed frightened of it. And then somehow, the Trevor remembered the creature's name. It was called the Mathematician.
that's not the button to eject. Um, there you go. We can switch to Sky real quick. Who is currently drowning? Oh, looks like it's done doing what it needs to do. The mathematician vanished as quickly as he had appeared. Back to. To what? What lay behind the cylinder? Well, only one of us will be able to figure it out. Just gotta be very careful when we tread this area. That oh, yep, especially careful. I see those things, and that scares me. Ooh, boy. Oh, I should have taken a picture of the mathematician. God damn it. Yeah. Uh, maybe I can switch the sky so that she can carry some of our food now. That thing's giving us a lot of energy, so... like something made to contain water. But all it contained were these large rolling machines. Who had built these things and why? They were not servants of the cylinder, that much was clear. <laughs> I love this little thing. I don't know what it is, but it's so cute. Oh, it crushed one of them. Or multiple. Oh boy, that's not good. So, avoid these things at all costs. Good to know. Someone got hit, I assume. Or I guess Sky in this case. She probably got hit. Let's refresh our water. Curse of having, you know, powerful legs. Can't really get things that are like really close by. Oh, hey, there's a hatchery there. Well, now we're just gonna find an egg and get another member of the family. What the heck? Some ingredients cannot be eaten until their edible interiors have been exposed. There are multiple ways to break open your trash by like throwing them, crushing them, or feeding them to other creatures. Ones that break apart are marked with the yellow border and the inventory. Ah. Finally, the weeping trees that the elder had told them to find were within the Trebum's grasp. But though the Trebum were happy, they realized that they faced a new challenge. The ripe fruit were floating out of reach and the others were enclosed in a hard shell. They would have to find a way to crack them open. Well, that was easy for me. This balloon-like bloody allows the trim to float in the air at will. Oh boy, we have just lost about everything, okay. Oh, 
Well, only one thing to do. Oh, Jesus. So it's A to float. Doesn't seem like to be any limit too, so that's good. Let's get our water back up and we'll refill it. I look like Squidward now. Yeah, Squidward. Yeah, Squidward. Yeah, Squidward. All right, we gotta make sure at least one of us is carrying food. As long as one of us is carrying food, we should be fine. Well, I guess only one thing to do, and that's to feed. Next area. All right, let's do this. What thing are those things? Wait, oh, are those the um? I mean, what do I see here? I was trying to exude a ground pound by tapping jump again during a jump. Hmm. That's nice and all, but I kind of wish, you know, I actually had a point of actually using it. Because uh, we don't have access to it, it seems, with the current transformation we have here. Oh boy. So let's switch it out for probably something better. Now my buddy and I here, at least Sky and I here, can now jump at equal heights. Oh god, oh god, don't... Drown. Does the other... Uh, no. Not necessarily. 
We're gonna go into the assumption that audio quality is fine. I'm just too tired to check at the moment, so yeah. And since they're doing a solo stream, I don't have to worry about uh, everyone else's. Yippee. Jeez, one flung all the way over here. I want to figure out what these, like, crystal things are sometime soon. Encyclopedia, I can. Worm of the bunk caves, there's. Denseness, huh? see if there's like a way to like figure out like what this material is exactly for. So Inaka shield. Let's see here. It takes 35 seconds to process. Oh, wait a second. What if the food, the water processor processes this? Ah, uh, maybe. I mean, it could be stupid. Uh, Sky, where is she? There she is. I'm pretty sure that the little worms are like the process of things, so... Let's here, um... Unless maybe it isn't the case, which in case, uh-oh. the worm. I could have sworn I saw it earlier. Hmm. Let's see here. Oh, there it is. Let me just eat this. Now, I wonder what happens if I do this and then process... I'm gonna have to have, uh, you... Let's see here. Let's test it out with this. Can you process this? No, you cannot. Gone. Okay. Well, it's good to know. We we tried. Hmm. All right, let's get that back. And then we'll get you to absorb all this nutrient here. So I'm guessing we're gonna have to find a different thing 
to use to process the food. So I guess I'll handle the more important materials. Mm-hmm. 